Welcome to our channel Wave Entertainment. We are all about documenting South African stories. If you are new here, please consider subscribing so you can keep making more videos. It also going to help our channel to grow. Now, without further ado, let's get started with the video. South African producer, DJ and songwriter Sun L musician has achieved commercial success and international recognition with his warm, uplifting blend of deep house, quieto and pop. He is one of the primary artists associated with the Amapiano music which originated in Gauteng during the mid 2010s and became highly popular throughout South Africa by the end of the decade. After breaking through with his simmering 2017 single Agana Mali featuring something Soweto, he became an in-demand producer frequently working with vocalists such as Simi, Amifaku and Mtunzi all whom appear on the second Sanel musician full length to the world and beyond. Sanel Stolle was born in a small town called Moy River in KwaZulu-Natal in 1989. He was raised by his domestic mother with four other siblings. He briefly attended the University of KwaZulu-Natal in 2007 but dropped out. Shortly after he left school, Sanel spent two years at home and began his music career by remixing songs and creating mixtapes. Sanel then met Tanukwazi Demua Skosana, who signed him under his record label Demua Music. Sanel worked with Demua Music as a music producer for a period of five years. During that period, he worked with the house singer Busi from 2011 till 2014 and he produced three albums for Demoa Music. He moved to Johannesburg in 2015 and began pursuing his career as a musician. In 2016, he recorded Akana Mali, a song about being broke with the singer Something Soweto in a makeshift studio using donated equipment. Being a perfectionist, he wasn't satisfied with the song at first and it sat unreleased for months before his brother asked him to work on it further. It was released as his debut single in May 2017 and quickly became a huge hit, earning platinum certification and opening doors for numerous collaborations, both at home and abroad. Alicia Keys and Swiss Beats heard the song on their trip to South Africa and flew Sun L out to the States to work on music together. Sanel Musician's debut album, Africa to the World, was released in 2018, including further hit collaborations with Simi and other vocalists. Sanel Musician won several awards for Akana Mali at the 2018 South African Music Awards. Sonini, featuring Simi and Lele Kamau, won Record of the Year at the 2019 ceremony. Sanel founded his own record label, L World Music, and produced singles and album cuts for vocalists such as Amefaku, Sinom Solo, and Azana. His second full length, the double album To the World and Beyond, was released in 2020, featuring many of his regular collaborators, as well as Claudia, Kenza, Julia Church, and Kenyan band Saudi Soul, including numerous other musicians. He said, this album is a continuation of my debut studio album, Africa to the World, and is focused on telling a story of healing through dance music. The album cover art shows a portrait of Sanel musician dressed in traditional attire. An hour before its release, Sanel hosted a theme, well curated and executed virtual album launch where he played a set of some of the songs on the album and had some of the featured vocalists perform them. Additionally, Sanel co-produced Afro House legend Black Coffee single You Need Me featuring Magazine Ashley which appeared at the end of 2020 and was subsequently included in the 2021 album Subconsciously which won a Grammy award. In December 2022, Gala Record Company had selected Sanel Musician to join forces with Nobuhle, Muzi and other esteemed artists on an EP titled Music is Forever, where he put his own spin on classic song. Sun L star continued to rise as he headlined the Baseline concert on 21st May and the highly anticipated MTN Bushfire Festival, which took place in Picture Square, Markham's Valley. 
it was yet another triumphant chapter in Sanel Musician's already storied career. In December 2022, Sanel Musician then announced his third studio album, African Electronic Dance Music, set to be released in 2023. Sanel wrote on social media, African Electronic Dance Music, to me, I would define it not just as a sound that designates a single genre, but more of a sound that encompasses a style of African elements infused with EDM, but it's a modern way of exporting the African dance sound to the rest of the world, going through giving it African traditional elements of drums, rhythm, and culture. Tapping into a craze that's conquering the world, a EDM is destined to be Sanel's reputation skyrocketed even further. Sanel Musician has proven multiple times he's a force to be reckoned with. He is one of the few house music producers that is thriving in a climate where everybody is doing ama piano. For Wave Entertainment, I am Kepitizi. Be sure to subscribe to the channel. Let us know in the comment section which Sanel Musician song is your favorite and what you like about him. Also, you can check out my music in the description. Until next time guys, 